してみんなどこでハブにあったわけ？私はね、うん、おじいときび畑で仕事をしていたわけさ。うん、キビをかき分けたら、うわあ！ハブハブハブハブハブハブハブハブハブハブハブハブハブハ庭で草刈りしていたときに、うん、深い草むらかき分けたら、何？ハブ、ハブ。ワンワンよ、現場の資材置き場で資材を持ち上げようとしたそのとき、おお、ハブ。そういえばワンも昨日の夜飲んだ帰りに夜道を歩いていると危ない危ないみんな危なかったんだねうん、本当危機一発だったわね、うん、でもさ、もし噛まれていたら今頃どうなっちゃっていたわけ Let me explain People who have been bitten have had similar encounters with habu snakes as you had experienced earlier today. Most people get bitten on their farm or in their own garden. That's about 70% of all incidents. These habu snakes are nocturnal, so they rest in the daytime. They are likely to bite when people get too close while they are sleeping. So, you can easily get bitten in the daytime, so please be careful. 90% of habu bites are to the hands and feet because they are the parts of the body that habu snakes usually make contact with first. The venom of habu snakes contains a chemical that causes pain and swelling, so it's very painful and it swells up. The symptoms of bites vary depending on the bite location, amount of venom, and personal condition. みんな本当に噛まれててもおかしくない状況だったんだね。怖い怖い怖い。ところでさ、沖縄にはどんな種類のヘビがいるのかね。沖縄にいるヘビすべてがこんな怖い毒持ってるわけじゃないよね。There are more than 20 kinds of snake in Okinawa Prefecture. There are 11 kinds of snake on the mainland of Okinawa. Of those, four kinds are considered dangerous venomous snakes. They are the Habu snake, Hime Habu, Sakishima Habu, and Taiwan Habu. Let me introduce these four Habu snakes. This snake is a habu snake. Usually, all snakes are called habu, but strictly speaking, this is the habu snake. The average length is about 130 centimeters, but when they are born, it's only about 40 centimeters. When they get older, some grow to longer than two meters. And this yellowish color with complex patterns is indicative of habu snakes. 
Its favorite prey are rats and Asian house shrews, and it lives in the woods, on farms, and even near housing areas. Habu snakes are good at climbing trees and swimming. This is true for other kinds of snakes, but the color and patterns of the snakes may be different depending on regional and individual differences. So, don't be careless when you see one that's different from what you saw last time. This is called Hime Habu, meaning Princess Habu. It's smaller than other snakes. And the average size is about 40 centimeters. Even bigger ones only get to about 80 centimeters. Small ones can be as little as 10 centimeters. This one is a bit chubby looking. In the Okinawan, they are called Kukpa or Nibuya, meaning sleepyhead. But when they are angry, they can move very fast. So please be cautious. Their reddish brown color and big eyes are striking. This is the Sakishima Habu. Sakishima Habu used to live only in the Yaeyama Islands. However, they were brought to the Okinawan mainland by humans and they started to live in the south. The average size is about 80 centimeters and smaller ones are only about 20 centimeters. Bigger ones can grow to be 1.2 meters long. The color is brownish with small spots. In rare cases, an orange colored snake can be found. They live across vast areas, including mountainsides and residential areas, preying on rats, lizards, and frogs. Just as other habu do not hibernate in winter, neither do Sakishima habu, so be careful. This is the Taiwan habu. It lives in eastern areas of the Asian continent, as well as Taiwan. However, they were introduced to Okinawa by humans, and they live in the central to northern parts of the Okinawa mainland. The average is 80 centimeters, and the biggest is 1.3 meters. Smaller ones are only about 20 centimeters. It's brownish gray with small black spots. It looks similar to the Sakishima habu, but the Taiwan habu is thinner. It eats rats, Asian house shrews, and frogs. There are other snakes in Okinawa that we haven't mentioned, but most of them are harmless. So that you don't threaten those harmless snakes for no reason, you should learn how to pick out habu snakes from others. One of the differences between habu snakes and other snakes is the shape of their head. Snakes belonging to the habu family have a triangular head. However, the akamata's head becomes triangular when it's angry, so it's not always easy to tell. Anyway, the important thing is to try to find out the color and other body features. The Akamata and Habu snake's patterns are totally different. Akamata snakes have big red and black stripes, whereas Habu snakes have a complex black pattern on a yellowish body. This is Habu. Oh, According to the famous quote by Sun Tzu written in The Art of War, if you know the enemy and know yourself, you need not fear the result of a hundred battles. That is to say, knowing about habu snakes means minimizing the harm. これで終わった家族はそう簡単にハブに噛まれることはないだろうな。でも、死後遺産してからにそういうやつがそう噛まれるんだよ。ようこそ。<笑><笑>
That's right. ヤシが万が一ハブに噛まれてしまった場合はどうすればいいわけ First aid treatment. If by chance you get bitten by a habu snake, stay calm and get medical attention immediately. First, look at the snake and decide if it's a habu snake. Even if you don't know the kind of snake, if it's a habu snake bite, it usually leaves two pierce wounds. Soon, it will become painful and swollen. If so, call out for help. And get yourself to the hospital. If you move around too much, the venom will travel around your body faster. So have someone drive you to the hospital, or if you walk, walk slowly. If it will take a while to get medical attention, tighten up a part of your body that's closer to your heart than the bite. This will slow down the flow of the bloodstream. It's important not to tie it too tight. Allow one finger to easily go between the bandage and the skin. If it's too tight, it may cause blood clots. Loosen once every 15 minutes. It's essential to get to the hospital as fast as you can. If you're not treated properly, You might suffer permanent injury. That's not good. If you don't do anything about the habu snake you encountered in the housing area, someone may get bitten. So, get rid of it if you can. It's important not to get bitten. If a group of children sees a habu snake, call out for adults. Habu snakes can only attack by half of their body length. So, even if you see a giant two meter long snake, you'll be fine if you keep 1.5 meters between you and the snake. They don't jump. So, just keep your distance and you'll be safe. If you need to fight them, use a long stick. Don't try to catch them alive. Dial 110 for the police in case of emergency. If the habu snake disappears after you've seen it, Call the local authorities. They will set a snake trap. And if a habu snake is caught, they will take it away. That's right. Very good. First, we have to create an environment where you can spot a habu snake immediately. Locating danger in advance will help you avoid facing it. If you prepare for habu snakes, you'll be prepared for other snakes too. For example, don't wait too long before mowing the lawn. Set up lights in dark areas. Don't put your hands in a bush or closely covered areas. When you walk in the dark, use a flashlight to keep an eye on where you're walking. When you walk on an overgrown, hilly road, use a long stick to make sure there are no obstacles. By following these instructions, the chances of getting hurt go down greatly. The next important thing is to make an uninhabitable environment for the habu snakes. 
Pack stone walls with small stones so that harbor snakes won't live in the gaps. Weed frequently. Don't leave out building materials. Don't leave out trash for rats to feed on, which in turn would attract habu snakes. In public places, such as schools, fences or walls are erected to avoid letting habu snakes in. It is crucial to use small nets so that no habu snakes can get through. Concrete walls are easier to maintain because there is no worry about weeds getting entangled. Nylon nets are suitable for short-term use, such as on construction sites. The key is to set the net to make a slope against the habu snake side. Make sure you put the poles behind the net so that the habu snake cannot use them to climb up. If possible, put concrete on the ground. Do not leave any gaps for habu snakes to pass through. Many municipalities in Okinawa have been working hard to minimize the risk of habu snakes. In Naha City, they provide materials to keep habu snakes out. If you get bitten, they'll cover the cost of the treatment. They also put signs up to remind people that habu snakes may be in the area. In Urasoi City, the city rents neglected land and maintains it as a farm for everyone to enjoy. As for the Okinawan government, in order to ensure suitable treatment for habu bites, they purchase anti-venom and distribute it to major medical facilities. Also, the Okinawa Prefecture Institute of Health and Environment, a research facility in the prefecture, is studying ways to minimize habu snake-related injuries. Habu snakes are important creatures. To them, humans are a huge animal. When they face those huge animals, habu snakes get scared and bite. So, as much as possible, we have to make sure we don't encounter habu snakes so that we can have the best situation for both groups. It's hot! I haven't been out in the daytime for a while. Habu hakase te... Habu no te shindatta no? Looking for some shade. 